Hello kids. In this, we will learn some of the nature things. Squirrels. Squirrels are generally clever and persistent animals. Ground and tree squirrels are typically diurnal. Hyena. The hyena is a mammalian family of order carnivore. Hyena seem to have originated 26 million years ago. Brinjal. Brinjal is a plant of the family Solanchae and genus Solanum. It bears a fruit of the same name. Commonly used as a vegetable in cooking and is native to India and Sri Lanka. Cactus. Cactus is a member of the spine plant family Cacti, native to the Americas. They are often used as ornamental plants, but some are also crop plants. Quinine Quinine is a natural white crystalline alkaloid having antipyretic. Quinine was the first effective treatment for malaria. Papyrus Papyrus is a thick paper-like material produced from the pith of the papyrus plant. Cypress papyrus. Papyrus usually grow 2 to 3 meters tall. Giraffe. The giraffe is the tallest of all land living animal species and the largest ruminant. They prefer areas with plenty of acacia. Mushroom. A mushroom is a fleshy spore bearing fruiting body of a fungus typically produced above ground on soil or on its food source. Snail Snails that have a broadly conical shell that is not coiled or appears not to be coiled are often known as limpets. Snails can be found in a wide range of environments from ditches, deserts. Bladderwort Bladderwort is a common name given to the plants of the genus Utricularia. The largest genus of carnivorous plants, it consists of some 215 species which occur in fresh water. Waterfall A waterfall is usually a geological formation resulting from water, often in the form of a stream flowing over an erosion-resistant rock formation that forms a nick point or sudden break in elevation. Dune Dune is a hill of sand built by aeolian processes. Dunes are subject to different forms and sizes based on their interaction with the wind. Rainbow a rainbow is an optical and meteorological phenomenon that causes a spectrum of light to appear in the sky when the sun shines onto droplets of moisture in the earth's surface. The mother of pearl. These clouds are considered as the highest clouds that exist in the sky. Avalanche. An avalanche is a rapid flow of snow down a slope from either natural triggers or human activity, typically occurring in mountainous terrain. Iceberg An iceberg is a large piece of freshwater ice that has broken off from a snow-formed glacier or ice shelf and is floating in open water. Hurricane a hurricane is a storm system characterized by a large low pressure center and numerous thunderstorms that produce strong winds and flooding rain. They are the most destructive storms. Tsunami A tsunami is a series of waves that is created when a large volume of a body of water, such as an ocean, is rapidly displaced. Earthquakes, volcanic eruptions, and other underwater explosions, and other mass movements. Canyon A canyon or gorge 
is a deep valley between cliffs often carved from the landscape by a river. Most canyons are formed by a process of long time erosion from a plateau level. Tides Tides are the rising of Earth's ocean surface caused by the tidal forces of the moon and the sun acting on the oceans. Tides cause changes in the depth of the marine. Sea wasp jellyfish. It is the most deadly sea creature. Its sting can kill a person in less than 3 minutes. Peregrine falcon. The peregrine falcon, also known simply as the peregrine and historically as the duck hawk in North America, is a cosmopolitan bird of prey in the family Falconidae. Song thrush. It has brown upper parts and black spotted cream or buff underparts and has three recognized subspecies. Singing is bird's way to communicate. Koala. The koala is native to Australia and the only extant representative of the family Fascolarcatidae. The koala is found in coastal regions of eastern and southern Australia. It eats only eucalyptus tree leaves. Frilled Dragon Frilled Dragon is so called because of the large ruff of skin which usually lays folded back against its head and neck. When the lizard is frightened, it gaps its mouth showing a bright pink or yellow lining. 